All right, uh, with the, uh, in light of our recent situation over at Arxis, uh, you know, people who make Guilty Gear, Blaze Blue, all those guys, you know, uh, with the arriving, with the Blaze Blue 3 arriving this winter, I just have to say, I'm really excited about that. Let me get that out of the way now. I'm glad that Blaze Blue has a third installment because, as you know, many fighters aren't that lucky to get a third installment so soon, but Blaze Blue, as young as it is, on its third year, has its third main installment, and I am proud of Blaze Blue. Blaze Blue has come a long way. But there is one thing I have to say here about this. I'm addressing the Guilty Gear fans in this video right now. Guilty Gear fans, get over it. Get over it. I mean, if you guys were like, want to have a three, you would have had one by now. Maybe after Blaze Blue 3, you'll get your three. But I am just simply disgusted at the fan re uh, reaction. What? Blaze Blue 3, but no Guilty Gear 3? Oh, Blaze Blue sucks. It's like, you guys, ever since Blaze Blue was made, you hated it just for the simple fact it was Blaze Blue. Yeah, if you truly wanted to support the franchise, instead of being some whiny bitches, whiny entitled bitches about it, you would buy the game hoping that if you buy it, He'll support them and give them, give them enough money to sign up another Guilty Gear franchise. You'd think you'd do that. But no, you shoot yourself in the foot by talking about, I'm going to boycott it until, until, you know, until I get it back. I'm an entitled Guilty Gear fan with no friends. This game is so much better competitively than Blaze Blue. You know damn well you all play that game by yourself. Well, you can't find me a single American arcade where that shit was being played. Could you? Yeah. Where? I don't know. It's coming out soon, isn't it? It's coming out soon. Exactly. So stop pitching. You're not getting a three. You're getting an R. We're going to get a three soon. Oh, bless your heart. Who believes the three is coming out? Screw you. Right? This is the kind of optimistic, this is the kind of optimistic fanboy as you need in your community right now. Because quite frankly, you're all, you're all a lot of optimism, aren't you? With the recent release of Persona 4 Arena, you guys are just shocked, dumbstruck. Ah, what what is happening? This game is made for people. You guys somehow some some of the old fight. I have a beef with the old fighting generation in general. You make a game more user friendly, and you guys have a problem with it. You're like, what? You could actually learn combos in an hour now? Yes, that's how it should be. Are you telling me that I should have to take eight hours out of my day to fucking learn a simple ass combo? Mm -hmm. Now the kids. Now the controls are actually good and useful in society, you're all like, no! I'm talking about, like, it make it easier to do and people get upset about it. It's not easy. Even when you make it easier, it does not make the game easier. Isn't that right, Tega? Do you know my experience still triumphs, even though you can learn these moves? So that's what I'm saying. Why waste your time learning the moves? Ignoring that because it's not true. Anywho, uh -huh, sure. you have to rely on justice to beat my ass. Right. And anyone, any other legitimate character. No way, I'm a full-time kid. Kai? I can beat Kai with full-time kid. You can get him sometimes. Majority of the time. I'm telling you, I can beat you with full-time kid. Majority of the time. You have not played me since I trained. You have not. Oh, man. Man, you guys have some beef about Persona 4 being too easy and shit. But none of you play it. You just sit back and judge it. It has an auto combo button, doesn't it? Well, I'm a finished board. Oh, uh, no. Because auto combo nerfs the damage. Da -da 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 -da. You know, all that bullshit. So if you're really mad about that, you got some problems, motherfucker. You got some problems. You entitled Guilty Gear fans make me sick. I don't know what to do with you anymore. I love Guilty Gear. I played that way before I played Blaze Blue. I got an accent core on Christmas Day. I was happy as a schoolboy. Because I was a schoolboy. I still am. But you motherfuckers still upset about it. You're like, ah! Blaze Blue sucks. I like school, girl. School, girl. Ah, 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 ah. Even a school girl knows that Guilty Gear fans need to get over it. I guess you And I'm not even trying to say Blaze Blue is better or any anything else is better. I love all the games, all right. But I'm not. I'm telling you, Guilty Gear fans, to shut the fuck up. Every fucking Blaze Blue thread, they're like, it's not Guilty Gear. Oh, they make up some bullshit as to why they, get, they think the game sucks or something. Like, oh, there are, there are too many combos in it. What? What? It's too combo based. Oh, you mean like every fighter out there except for Tekken? Get the fuck out of my face with that bullshit. Hey, oh, Tekken is so, so caliber. Whatever, man. I can't stress this enough. And then when there's a game that's made that's not user friendly, you guys flock to it. 
best game of the century. I know what you want. You guys are the own little secret club. I've deconstructed what you are. You're a bunch of hipsters, basically. Uh, we have our secret guilty game club. No one can join us. It's all us. Yeah, I like it when it was popular. And if guilty gear does get popular, you guys are gonna stray, stray away from that shit. I'm gonna say dice game made the controls too easy to get used to. I liked it better when I had to hurt myself over the fucking controller, almost breaking all my wrists to actually learn a fucking uh, B and B combo. Get the fuck out of my face with that bullshit. You're telling me because it becomes more popular amongst people, you think it's less of a game. I'll tell you what's less of a game. Street Fighter. Well, that's another day. Uh, another story for another day. Anyway, man, you guys gotta get over it, man. I mean, how, how long? What? 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 What are you complaining about? Games being too easy. You got instant kills in Guilty Gear. Don't forget that. I mean, not saying it's an easy game. And then you complain about games not being balanced as Guilty Gear. Do you have any idea how unbalanced the first game was? Ten years later, they finally have a balanced game, and you're acting like it was a masterpiece from the start? But, oh, no, no, that's you're full of shit when it comes to that. There's no fucking way that was the case. But a lot of you don't know that, do you? You just jump on the hating bandwagon, and then you don't think before you speak. And now you end up in the situation you are. No games to play, no fighters to play. And when Guilty Gear does come out, you're going to get thrashed. And you ain't been keeping up, man. you just be like, oh my god. I just want that's going to make a Guilty Gear 3. I don't want to play anything else made by them. It's all easy shit. It's all easy shit. You guys are pathetic. You're pathetic. Now, people who enjoy Blaze Blue and Guilty Gear, such as myself, equally, now those are the people I admire. As hard as they are to find. And they, oh, yeah, you know what else they say? They say, Blaze Blues with, for Weeaboos. Let me ask you this. Guilty Gear never had a uh, fucking uh, English track. Doesn't that make that a fucking uh, Weeaboo game? Stupid. Hypocritical. Ugly motherfuckers. You can't stand motherfuckers like that. Now, whenever Guilty Gear 3 comes out, I hope you guys enjoy it. But for now, you just gotta shut the fuck up and take what you can get. <laughs> and shut the fuck up, man. I'll tell you all that one more time. You know my video one more time and kick your ass.